This is the easiest and free way to get started on making content on YouTube. What's up YouTube? I'm back with another video on my channel. Today we're going to be talking about answer the public and what do I mean by that is I'm going to talk about how you can use answer the public to learn more about your content and to learn more about what type of videos to do. A lot of you ask me what type of video should I do or how do I get started? What you can see here is on the home page here you have this option here and let's say that you wanted to make a video. Um, let's do YouTube because that's the easiest one by far. Once you do a search, first you're going to be greeted with all of this data. And you can see that it is organized by R, will, why, where, when, who, which, what, how, can, etc. And what you can do is that you can actually sort it by data like this. And then what you can see here is this actually helps rank all of the questions that people have when it comes to your topic. Now, can you kind of see why this would be beneficial? This is pretty much aggregating what Google is telling us and it is putting it all in a consumable way so that you can actually look and see what people are looking for. The easiest way for you to succeed on this platform, for you to be able to make the best out of your time is to understand your audience. Uh, what the audience likes, what the audience doesn't like, what the audience is looking for, where they're looking for it, how often they're looking for it, what day of the week, etc. So, I'm an expert in YouTube, but there's so many things I can talk about. I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna be able to see, well, how the YouTube algorithm works. I like to uh, make videos about that because I understand the YouTube algorithm pretty well. Uh, there's also, let's say, when uh, when does YouTube give money or when does YouTube monetization starts? I can make a video about that as well. You can see this is what the demand is. This is what your audience is. How do you know what the audience wants? This is how you know what the audience wants. Now, in this section here, um, this one starts off with the questions and they're ranked by popularity, but you can also see there are prepositions and this one is lesser talking about the questions. This, once again, this gives us a good wealth of data in terms of what people are looking for. And then from there, you can decide what type of content you like out of what people are looking for. That is pretty much the easy, go-to strategy that you can start right away because that way you can do something that you're passionate about and you also know that there is demand for these topics. Um, and then one more per, uh, section here, which is talking about YouTube comparisons. This one is showing more in terms of like and, like, or. So this is very interesting, useful data. So I could make a video talking about YouTube versus Twitch which is a popular gaming platform and YouTube has been going hard in the YouTube gaming industry. They've been signing creators, etc. So this can be a topic that I can do, YouTube versus TikTok, of course. Um, that's also a big thing. So overall, this is completely free. You don't need to pay anything. You can get started with your market research today by using Answer the Public. Like you want to know what your audience wants and, and that way you can cut through all the competition and hit the right people and start making content. You put in the topic that you do um, and you can also see I actually uh, searched this for Canada. Uh, so you can even choose by country. You put in the topic that you want to make content on, make sure that it's a, it's not too narrow of a topic. And then from there, you will be able to have a lot of good data, a lot of good starting points where you just start creating content calendar, where you start thinking of ideas that you can make content for. And then from there, video ideas will turn into real videos. That's gonna be it for my video today, talking about Answer the Public. I hope this video was informative. It's a free tool that you can use and let me know if you have any other questions. Otherwise, I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.